White Pepper was born in 2010 and launched with um, foraging skills, artisan bread making, um, fish and shellfish, patisserie skills and also game as well. And those types of topics remain at the heart of everything that we do. Our motto at White Pepper is press pause on life and reach your culinary potential fast. It's all about inspiration, commercial confidence and progressive skills. We love working with CTH and we have done for over a decade. What's so crucial um, for the students once they've achieved their skills is that it's then accredited with this international qualification which is really their springboard but also their passport um, for their career or food business. The reason I decided to study the CTH diploma at White Pepper um, was first and foremost that I had made a decision that um, the qualification was important to me um, but I think quite uniquely White Pepper were offering um, the ability to complete the course within about a four month period which very much suited my lifestyle. White Pepper just looked like a you know, good place to come, you know, you know medium size, not so bit more personal than other academies, um, nice location. Um, so yeah, that was, that, was, that was my main sort of motivation for coming here too. And um, also I've been a chef for many years and worked in a few places, but I wanted to fill in some sort of gaps in my knowledge that I had from, you know, stuff that I was on the menus in places I'd worked and, you know, broaden my culinary skills. The thing that I've most enjoyed uh, so far, um, I've been six weeks in, is the, um, the butchery and the meat part of it, as uh, my business is predominantly fish. For me, the dessert stuff that we've done, the patisserie, uh, because it's a section that I've never really worked at in restaurants, so I don't have much experience there or knowledge there, so it's been really good. Um, I've also developed a lot more skills um, in that area um, with things that I used to struggle with and find quite challenging. Um, I'm now a lot more confident that I could actually maybe work in you know, a dessert section or as a patisserie chef. I think the secret for being a, a really good chef is to be really friendly, patient, be good with your timings. There's a saying, you know, never jeopardise good food for pace but never jeopardise pace for good food, you know, del deliver both at the same time. Hard work because to succeed in the industry you've got to prepare to put the hours in, you know, they're not short days. But wherever you are, the tutors will give you the support you need to be successful. The fact that the CTH qualification is internationally recognised is really important to me actually and I do, I do want to take advantage um, and be able to work abroad. Certain countries absolutely require you to have um, a level four diploma for example so that was a decision I took. Um, specifically I think I'd love to um, spend some time in Australasia, so Australia and New Zealand, um, potentially as part of an extended um, tour. I've travelled a bit before when I was younger and there's absolutely no place like home so um, yeah my dream would be to have my seafood business on the beach selling local produce which Dorset is renowned for. I think for anyone considering studying the CTH diploma at White Pepper, um, the advice I'd give them is just just don't don't be concerned about it. Don't be afraid. I had some, I guess I had some slight apprehension about it um, with my limited cooking background. I wouldn't say there's any need for anyone to be sort of worried if they've not had any kitchen experience before because the tutors are very in depth, very in detail about you know the, what they teach and how they teach it. Um, it's not. A, it's not under pressure sort of environment, you know, they give you the skills that you need for a kitchen. I spoke to the tutors and it just got my heart racing, pumping. I loved it and wanted to be here and doing it and no regrets. It's been an amazing experience to return back to the kitchen at home and my business for next season with confidence and that's definitely what I've got out of the academy school here.